Welcome to Message Media. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Message Media integration in NetSuite to send messages to individuals and contact lists, as well as having a look at conversation management and message logs. Once you've installed and configured the Message Media bundle, you'll see two new buttons appear on the customer screen, SMS and Conversational UI. Clicking on the SMS button will open the single SMS window, where you can send quick messages to the main contact number assigned to this customer. Start by selecting the relevant contact number from the drop-down list on the left. If you have any saved templates that you want to use to pre-populate this message, just select the desired template from the drop-down list. Templates are created by clicking on Message Media in the top right, then Template, and then New Template. If you're sending this message to a customer who has custom information saved in their customer profile, you can include this information in your message by selecting the relevant field from the Merge Fields drop-down when you get to the point in the message at which you wish to add this field. Once you've constructed your message in the Compose field, click Preview SMS to see how your message will present to your recipients. This preview will also contain the header and footer which can be edited in the configuration section. You'll also see that there's a character count and a credit count to help you manage your spend. Click on Configuration to open the Configuration tab. Here you can edit the header and footer for your message. It's always a good idea to identify yourself in the header so your recipients know who the message is coming from, and also to provide an opt-out keyword in the footer. Depending on the context of your message, this may actually be a legal requirement. If you want to schedule your message to be sent at a specific time or date, tick the Schedule SMS box and set the date and time in the fields that follow. Or, if you want to send the message immediately, just click Send SMS. You can also send SMS messages to individuals within an organisation. Just click on the contact name to open the profile, and you'll see the SMS button appear at the top in the contact profile window. The function is the same as before, with the only difference being that when choosing the recipient, the options are limited to the contact numbers saved for that particular contact. To send messages to multiple contacts at once, Go to Message Media in the top menu bar and then select Batch SMS followed by New Batch SMS. Start by selecting your recipient source by using either the Saved Search option or a key link. You can then select the desired recipients from the resulting list or just use the Select All option. As previously, with the single SMS send, you can use Save Templates if desired and Merge Fields for personalization. It's a good idea to always tick Track Message Delivery so you can track whether or not the message has been sent successfully. Once you're happy with your message, click on the Configuration tab in the menu bar where, as previously, you can edit your header and footer as well as opt to schedule your message to send at a later time and date. This time, however, you also have the option to set your message to become recurring. Simply select the recurring interval from the list on the right and then tick the box to ensure the recurrence is active. When you're ready to send your message, click Send SMS. The conversational UI allows you to manage real-time conversations with customers similar to an online chat service. This function is only available at the customer level, meaning that the dialogue shown will only include messages sent to and received from the primary customer contact. To send a reply, just type your message in the message field at the bottom and click on the send icon. You'll notice your signature on the left, which will apply automatically to every message you send in the conversation. Your signature is the same as the footer which you've saved as the default for your messages. To edit your signature, just click on the SMS button, then open the configuration tab and edit the content of the footer before clicking on save default. Under each message, you'll find sender details, delivery time, and, for sent messages, a delivery status. To view messaging activity on a specific account, click on Messages in the lower menu bar. 
This will bring up a list of all messages sent to and received from contacts on the account. Outbound messages are identified in the subject column as Message Media SMS, while inbound replies are labeled Message Media Reply SMS. You can view each message by clicking on View, and you can remove the message from the list by clicking Remove on the right-hand side. It's worth noting that removing a message from the message log will not remove it from the conversational UI. For a comprehensive downloadable PDF user guide for the message media integration in NetSuite, visit our help site at support.messagemedia.com. Just click on the Automations and Integrations category where you'll find a link to a downloadable user guide. Thanks for using Message Media, the best way to send engaging messages to your customers.